YouTube, what is good? Today's Tuesday, February 7th. Got some orders going out from over the weekend. Let's start from this top row. Uh, actually, let's start from this bottom row. We're gonna start off here. We got some Kobe 5 undefeated. Brand new, really clean pair. This is like the only Kobe we get in store now. We have the beautiful Dion Diamond Turf. We have some Air Max 95s. We got some Iguana, Dunk Highs, Jordan 1 Fats, Jordan 1 SBs. We got a used University Blue 4 size 11 and a half that we try to sell on Saturday and then over the weekend. We're thankful enough for it to sell. We got two Two fire fours and a military blue and a, a guava. We've been getting a lot of military blue fours in lately. It's kind of weird. I think that one's an eight and a half. Just so like a nine and a half last week. I think we got like another nine and a half. We got some beautiful guava fours. Beautiful sneaker right there. Not my favorite out of the Union Four pack, but definitely the second best. Comment down below. What's the best four out of the Union Four collection? We got some really clean cool gray threes that you guys saw us buy at the sneaker show a couple weeks ago. We got some winter rise fourteens. We got some legend blue low elevens. These are pretty clean. You know, nice little low top shoe for the spring that's approaching. Denim, Air Max 1s, these are brand new, I believe like a size 13. Then you see a bunch of ones. We have some Starfish ones, just sold one last week, sell another one today, pretty cool. You got some like paint splatter mids, a lot going on there, I'm not really a fan of those, but the meaning's cool, I guess. You got the Nike check as like a paintbrush. You got some silver toe lows, you got some um, shadow toe lows, I think that's like the bread or black toe mids. You got some stage haze, you guys should've saw us off camera, we were running around with like a chicken with no head because we have two used pairs we kind of got them like mixed together so we had to sort that situation out but a pretty good one that's going out and it actually go for some bread surprisingly we got some brand new obsidian ones we got to use hyper royal beautiful 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 royal one next to an ugly biohack then we got an alternate bel air and then uh we got a fire red five two five well fives don't really move like that but two fives that sold that's been sitting on ebay for a while we got some agassiz right here look at this man the color on these are crazy we have the other pair over there in the corner on display. This is such a fire pair. I believe we got this in two weeks ago. I think I bought these off camera, but again, not a shoe that walks in the store every day. Every time we do get these though, these do fly out the door pretty fast. Undercover Sakai's. Last week, you're gonna see that we bought these. The Mets Dunks, the Paisley SBs. Really fire sneaker. Beautiful, clean SB for under 200 right now. If I could find a nine and a half use, possibly in these, I might cop. But again, pretty cool sneaker. Got another layer underneath. Talk about another good SB. The Skate Like a Girl. I'm not usually a fan of this burgundy or maroon colorway but i really do like it i forgot the name of those but those are like a, like a crater sb we got some rubber dunks that i bought like a long time ago they weren't up on the ebay for some weird reason got them up on ebay and sold pretty quickly shout out to will but will's like every week will's buying something he bought a shadow 2.0 size six and a half right next to that we have a beautiful mocha one and like a size five we got a clean clean carno three we got a beautiful black 992 we got a uh 2002 r has a pocket we got some quantums and then we have some um how's it going 500 like granted which is the most expensive pair the most expensive pair yep. me and my little boy were at a foot locker he was looking at nike's most expensive wow. pair might be that pair how much that's you so that one sold for like around like 600 wow and they're yeah. used. They're used, yeah. yeah. And brand still new. 600. Brand How much new? brand new? Like seven to 800, depending on sizes. Okay. So like right. the bigger the size, the more they go for. The smaller Have you size. ever had one in the thousands? Yeah. In this store? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like probably like this shoe uh -huh. right here is worth, that's used again, but that one's worth like 1200. Wow. This one is worth, we have it up online for like 2700 This one's like a uh, thousand, another thousand right here. These so even used Nikes are worth money. Mm -hmm. Depending on like if majority of time, yeah. if it's like a collab, they usually okay. go for a lot of money because everyone wants some and yeah. the hype drives the price up. But lately the price has been coming down, but there are like a lot of sneakers in the thousands though, for wow. sure. Interesting. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt. No, no, you're okay, man. You're okay. You too, man. Thank you. Shout out to UPS, man. Always dropping packages off. Come down here. That's some AOD A27. If you guys saw the video about these, the guavas. So I'm really happy about this. Got some pure money. Another shoe we kept trying to find this morning, and the entire time it was back there. They look really, really good in this 
in this condition. I'm not gonna lie. You got the Syndergaard jersey. You got a Dominique Wilkins um, UGA jersey. One of my favorite players to me, the second greatest wide receiver of all time, Terrell Owens Eagles jersey. I feel like black Eagles jerseys are like up there for top five jerseys in the NFL. Hate McNabb. You got two McNabb jerseys. You know, Super Bowl week. Really, really excited. Comment down below who you guys think gonna win. I got the Eagles. I've been saying the Eagles all year. You can fact check that. You can go back in previous videos. I've been saying Eagles all year. We got the Penny. I forgot what shoe that was for, but I remember I had it when I was in high school and someone stole it out of my basketball locker. I was really sick about that. We got a Yates AOP NASCAR jersey, um, NASCAR t shirt, excuse me. And then we got a Fair God hoodie that we traded someone for a TSK hoodie. Yeah, that's everything. Evan? Best shoes here, in my opinion, are probably those military blues, those guavas. And also, shout out to the person who bought those Agassiz. You don't really see those too often. Shout out to the, person, the people who bought the, the Eagles stuff because I'm hoping that the Eagles win. And shout out to the person who bought that. NASCAR tee. We've had it for a minute. I don't know if it was up, but we put it up and it's old. Yeah, every time we get military fours in, they seem to sell and we've been getting them a lot of infrequently, like Jordan said. So glad to see those are always moving. Uh, love the guavas. That's probably my favorite one out of the Union four pack. Love seeing the Agassiz. Definitely a classic going out. All these SBs right here. Shout out to Marcus. He traded for the Lance Mountain SB ones. Shout out to him for bringing all the good stuff in. And then um, those new bounce up top. You know, I really love seeing good new bounces go out, especially those uh, 993s. Alrighty, that's about it. It is officially 12 o'clock down. Let's get this stuff packed up. I'll catch you guys shortly. And are you looking to sell, trade? Uh, sell or trade. Okay. What are you asking for these? 75 to 100. And these are used, tried on? Yeah. Used? Used. Okay. Yeah. How much you have? 50 to 200 in another area. Okay. So much here? Two. two. How much here? 175 to two. How much for these? Two to 250. Those, those aren't the, or I don't have the original box for those, but those are ones I would just want to hear what you have for them. Okay. Let's see. Here we go. This one you had nothing in mind? I'd be cool just having everything tick on to like a thousand. It's like 150 on those. And how much um, for these? The 72 tens? 150. Okay. But these I would probably hold off on just because okay. this is kind of like smoked and like, yeah. I just feel like super low for them. Right. Um, for this stuff here, I was at like seven for everything. I know you had these priced a little bit higher than I did. Okay. Um, I priced them like a little bit lower just because of what I saw them selling for like brand new yeah. on like stock. Um, so I was like, I was looking at stock and go to basically see like what they're selling for. So basically the breakdown is it was, um, it was 100, 100, um, 150, 75, 175 on the Desert Moss, and two on the um, the Oreos, the white Oreo fours. Right. Yeah, I can do that. That's cool. That's cool. Um, and what's the best way for you for payment? I mean, if you have cash, if not, you can do Venmo. Venmo? All right, cool. Second buy of the day. I forgot you guys wasn't with me on camera when I bought this stuff, but off camera when we opened, got some Salomons in, some Soleil's. These are pretty cool. Again, I don't think this is my speed, but I don't know. I may try to get a nine for the summertime just to beat up, run around. I don't know. This is a cool sneaker, though. I really like this sneaker. Then we already got a used pair in. Shoes, size nine. There's a couple of stuff I want to um, highlight that we just bought. First shoe right here. Or the AOD 991. Boom. Another cool model. It's not a model for me, but I know Jam's doing their brown pair like the 992s this year. The colorway is cool though. The green, the cream, and the like the grayish brown. These are really cool. Come with some extra laces. Got some green laces. So these are pretty dope. Uh, 72 to 10 box. White Oreo box. You guys know that type of stuff already. So I'm not really going to go into too much detail about those. Same thing with the Bordeaux. But do want to talk about these. Talk about one of the best new balance creators, or in my personal opinion, this is one of those pairs where you don't see all the time. It's probably only our 
second time, maybe third, getting this shoe in. The outsides, I remember they dropped exclusively in DC. At the time, I used to really, really want this pair. Not so much now. It is still a great collab. Got all these funky laces, the green. I think this is a shoe that's gonna go by pretty fast. You heard me talk about it earlier today when we saw the guavas. What's the best um, Union 4 out of the pack? We got a Desert Mawson. Not really a fan of this shoe. More the second um, batch because of this creasing. Again, it's a cool sneaker. I would change the laces though, me personally. I'll put like some cream laces in there, just give it a little pop. Got some stuff to flick up and clean. We got a hockey jersey, you know, we got the Parisi. Did I say name? Hope, I hope that's how you say his name. Cool. Nike jacket, the Apex Carolina Panthers jacket, the Poverty New York Knicks starter jacket. We got the New England Patriots. What's this Apex? Yeah, there's another Apex. Arkansas. Thank you, Windbreaker. So, bunch of stuff that we got over this past weekend and today. So, we're gonna flick this stuff up, get it clean, get them, get them up on the eBay, so one of you lovely subscribers can buy it. Together, separate. Well, this is just me. All right, just me, old me. I got these John right here. And these John right here. How much do you ask for everything? I mean, best work sign out. What like you for these, how much? Huh? Uh, how much do you need? Oh, there's a price set. 170. We have a 12 and 9 and a half. How much you want for these? Mm -hmm. I'll one right now. It's over. How much for these? Mm -hmm. That was like two. two. For the Billy Alice again? Uh, like 220. This stuff I will pass on. This pile to the right of me. So this stuff I'll hold off on. This stuff is stuff I'll probably be interested in. And you said what 170 here. So you don't want these right here? Yeah, this stuff I'll pass on it. I was a lot less on these two. Um, I was cool with the two here. You said 175 here. I was at 100 here. You said two here. Two is more where they're going for. I was at like 75. They sell for like 160. Um, this one, you said 150. 150 is more what they're selling for. They sell for like 140. So I was at 60 here. I believe I was at for everything. Uh, 435 for everything. Nah, not really. Those 700s don't really move for us. Yeah. And these, we, we have the we have a pair that that's been sitting there for like three years in the back. Michigan highs. Down highs don't move. Like we have one down there on the shelf. Just like chilling. Like we don't really um, and then I'll just pass them. Do a better option. Better price for them. So we They just sit for us, you know what I'm saying? Like right now with the pots is just buying stuff that's not gonna sit. Just stuff kinda wanna push out a little bit easier and quicker. Um this is stuff that we feel like we could, you know, we can move it get it in, get it out real fast. So um I got sixty. Hmm? Brand new, they're like 140. You gotta ask. More than that shit. Nah, I know. Ma. I ain't pay box price. No, no. <laughs> you going by box price. You said I'm going by box price? Right, right. That's what you're doing, right? Going by box price? No, no, I'm talking about what they're selling for. Oh, what they're selling for right now? They're selling now. for like 140. Box price is like 100, 110. What they're selling for right now is like 140. That's why I was at 60. Try to get 100, 120 tops, if that. Yeah, just let me know what you're thinking. Appreciate it, bro. No problem. 435? Yeah, 435. Alright, fuck it. You're getting uh, 450? Uh, that's cool. What's the best way for you? Hmm? What's the best way? Like Apple Pay, Venmo? No cash app. No cash app. Apple uh, Pay cool. Apple Pay cool, I bet. Look at the sell trade. Sell, my brother. Never even one of those. What are you asking for everything? 325 for everything. 325, 315.
tough. I might just pass on this stuff. All this stuff's going for like 100 or less. I, I'll just pass. Can you say you wanted 325? What's like, the best you could do, bro? You know how we do. Nah, I feel you, but this stuff is just low. Like, it's super low. Like, these are selling for like 99, 99, 100. No. Those I'll pass on. They're just not going for anything. It's just going to sit for us. It's going to sit. Yeah, I'll probably just have to hold off for now. Yeah, I'm sorry about no, that. No, it's all good, man. Damn, these are going for high, right? Yeah. It's shocking, man. They just kept like, climbing and climbing. They're nice. The, the materials on it are really nice. Yeah. Yeah, let I me mean, know what you're thinking. Or if you, or if you saw something that you're interested in. Uh, now we can work some out of cash, obviously. If that was the other pair, they, they wouldn't even be here. I wanted, the, I wanted the navy pair, but obviously you have no choice. What, it came in the, in the back? You yeah, it came, came in, in the, the bag, bag and everything? Yeah, oh. yeah, it's just like the mystery. You have no idea what that is. Do you have UNC dunks in my size, nine? The low tops? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I just pulled them out for someone the other day. Here? Yeah. Check them out. Yeah. It's actually funny, I bought a, uh, like, a lightly used pair at the at the show that I might keep for myself, and, and that's exactly Yeah, man, it's... They're pretty sweet. Oh, you're, you're a UNC I'm fan. A, yeah, yeah, it helps I'm a UNC, but, like, last night they just dropped a Jordan UNC jersey. I was like, uh, no hesitation. I really? Just, yeah. What are they, around, like, 250, right, the Huffs? 230. 230? These are around three. In um, my head, I was thinking, uh, well, you tell me what you're thinking if you want. Those are around three. Do like 285 for the Zions. And 210, 205. So, and, and, and you want these? Uh, I'm thinking maybe maybe these. I want to see what else we've got. So, maybe. what I was thinking was three on these, two on these. Basically, the same. That's cool, shoe. yeah, that's fine. I know these are like at three, but I just think it's a cool shoe. Doing them. I might actually go with these, to be honest with you. What's the price on these? Oh, honestly, I just looked up there. I just actually broke out with a uh, neutral, uh, natural grays. Uh, neutral gray, whatever the hell it is. 85s. Oh, the white and gray ones? Yeah. yeah. I mean, we probably usually have them at 5, call like, I don't know, 450 ish, something like that. Um, uh, I guess I'll take these. Um, I definitely want these for sure. Or, okay, yeah, cool. def I'll definitely take those over the over the dogs because just why not? And then if anything, I could just give you the remaining cash. Or we could just hold it because, like I said, I I got other shit I want to bring. Sure. What you hit me for retail? Yeah. Nice like Nike. Yeah. Six thirty. Wrap it up here. Got a lot of work done. A lot of stuff on Motor Weekend. A lot of sneakers from the warehouse got brought over. That's going up. Shoes we bought earlier today. All going up. So if you guys see anything you like, give us a call. DM us. And let us know you're interested, and we can try to work a deal out. Go around eBay. If you want to go through eBay, that's that's more than fine too. But yeah, that's it for me. Anything you guys want to say? Yeah, just a, a lot of bigger sizes going up on the eBay. So stay tuned. Well done. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> YouTube what is good we are here and we have a decent batch of orders going out definitely some good stuff I'm gonna start off up here we got the brand new GMP 7s going out with the American flag bag and all that got to shout out Lissandro he's been copping a lot of stuff from us so we appreciate the support all the way from California thank you so much here we have a beater pair of fire red forest next to a pretty beater pair of legend blue forest next to a brand new pair of the UNC University blue forest which man those things are selling for the high ski here we have a lightly used pair of Jordan 1 mids. You know what that looks like? It's like a nice little Eagles <laughs> Eagles colorway right there. Uh, we got the brand new Triax size 8. Always a good fan of those. Got the Clot size 8. Check the apps on those. They're literally going for under $100 brand new. That's just crazy to me, but it is what it is. It is kind of like a see-through sneaker, so not a lot of people can get down with that. Shouts to LeBron, of course, the all-time leading scorer. We got the SVSMs going out. Something different you don't really see often. Speaking of that, 3 Lab 5s used to be crazy hard sneaker to get when they first came out definitely great quality on those but you know not really everyone's cup of tea we got the crocs let's make sure to get the person who ordered the crocs some stickers because he definitely says he watches the channel and uh we're gonna end up sending him a new pair even though he paid for a used pair funny how things work here we have a crazy pair of air max i honestly forget what these are called the air max metals really cool sneaker i don't even remember them ever coming out on the apps or anything like that but uh just something that kind of came out under the radar here we got these new balances we had these for quite some time they finally sold we got the bleach core lows. We got the board.
Bordeaux ones. Those sold as used, even though they look brand new to me. Got a UCLA, lightly, lightly used. Nice little Bears hat there. Guys, the array of jerseys right here is just so beautiful. We got the Adam Morrison Authentic Bobcats joint. You will never see this one, guys, ever. Size 44 Adidas Authentic Adam Morrison. It took a long time to sell as rare as it is, but uh, that's because, you know, we had it up for a high dollar. And then we got the J.R. Smith Swingman. If you're ever out there and you see a J.R. Smith jersey, grab it, because they're actually pretty rare nowadays. And we got this beautiful Majestic Mets Padres. That about wraps it up for me. Anything for the people. I want to point out who now with the LeBrons. It's kind of funny because we had like a GOAT debate like the other day, like on Saturday or Friday. I'm not only get into that. It's LeBron's day. It's week, whatever. So shout out to LeBron because, you know, that is greatness right there. I'm a true legend. Just 20 years in the game and yeah, all-time leading score. That was pretty cool to watch last night. Two shoes literally bought yesterday. The Bordeaux and the UCLA's and they're going out the next day. So really proud of that because, you know, I like seeing stuff that we buy at least within like 24 hours. So that's pretty dope. The Crocs, really comfortable. The GMP, so shout out to Lisandro because he has been buying a lot from us or trading a lot from us. Like every day, there's like four boxes from him. Shout out to him. Three pairs of fours going out. Fire Red, Columbia, University Blue. You know, I'm going to call them the Eagle Mid Ones. Some Triax, some Cots. Of course, the best team in the NFL. The Bears hat, you know, Dunk High, another Low. Some beautiful Dead Stock Dino shoes that took so long to sell for like we had that shoe for almost three years. Got some Eric Emanuel shorts, Padres jersey, beautiful Mets jersey. That Adam Morrison. A lot of guys are not going to know who that is. In college, he was such a bucket. He was a bust in the NBA. He did have a couple games where he dropped 30, but such a letdown. And then, of course, New Jersey legend J.R. Smith. He used to ball on the Knicks. Memory that sticks out to me with J.R. Smith is when he reversed dunk against the Heat in the Garden. I think it was like Christmas. Yeah, nice little badge. Uh, shout out LeBron. Shout out to the person who bought those Triax. Uh, I feel like we have a, quite a few of those in a bunch of different sizes, and those are kind of a slept on sneaker. And shout out to the person who bought the Bobcat jersey. That's, that's rare. Shout out to the person who uh, bought the beanie. Shout out to LeBron for, you know, breaking the all time scoring record. Record. like these new balances right here and i also like these nikes they look like a 90s-esque type of air maxes so those are really cool and i really like this morrison jersey don't know much about the guy but that jersey's pretty fire yep that's about it because we got a lot of stuff to do so let's see what happens today now here's what i can tell you because i looked at your other ones your other jordan sixes your carmines your unc's your georgetowns those tags stay made in china or box for those will also stay made in china those are 100 percent so what is he trying to say? I promise you, get, get a little cheap $20 UV light. Like, are you just trying to let us know that? Absolutely, bro, because you guys have a very good reputation. I'm just letting you know. I'm not trying to call you out. I'm not so do you think, not, with, the, with the reputation you have, you think we're... I, I don't think you guys know, and I'm just warning you guys to know. Okay. I'm not trying to be absolute. So you're telling us our Midnight Navy 6s are fakes because they say made in okay. Vietnam and not made in China? Well, if you look at the box, your box will say made in China. Your tag says inside the shoe made in Vietnam. If those were legit, they would be just like your other Jordan 6s because I checked the tags on those online and all those say made in China. Okay, I'm so so you know, are you just... Okay, so you're just going off of it not matching the box to the shoe, and this is no, your info. Correct, because what I did was I have a pair of exactly like those that are fake, that I'm battling StockX on to say the same Oh, okay, so Stock, so, so StockX passed them as real, like you're right and StockX is wrong as well. So we're wrong, StockX is wrong, but you're right. No, 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 but I, I'm just trying to understand what's going on. So you bought a shoe on StockX. StockX passed it as real. You're fighting StockX, telling StockX that you think that this shoe is fake. You went on eBay and saw that we had a similar style that StockX passed as authentic, and you're letting us know because you believe that it's fake, correct? I'm just trying to make sure I, I understand what's going on here. Well, that is correct, but if okay. shoe was legit, it would so, so I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to be honest with you on this one. I'm going to say you should just let the people do their job correctly, right? Like, honestly, as much bull that we hear about StockX, the shoes that they sent you are real shoes, right? The shoes that we sell, made in Vietnam, made in China, they're real shoes. I understand what you're telling me, that you're trying to, like, help us, but these situations are just tough for us because we do this every day for a living. So, like, I don't know what you do for a living every single day, but I know that I'm not going to risk my reputation on the Midnight Navy 6 out of all sneakers. I get you, and here's what I'll tell you. Do what you want to do with this. If you take it, you and you go through that shoot and you take a UV light and you go through your other sixes, you will see what I'm referring to. I promise. 
But again, la well, last time, I just need to make this clear. You bought a sneaker from StockX. They passed them as authentic. You received them. And just because the box doesn't match the inside tag of where it's from, you're assuming that the sneaker is not authentic and you're fighting back with StockX. And because you're fighting with StockX over a shoe that you believe is fake, you're letting us know and telling us that our shoes are fake. I'm just telling you to check. You do what you want with the information. Now, here's what I will tell you. My UNC6s all match. China. Why does a UNC 6 have to match a Midnight Navy 6? Why does a Midnight Navy 6 have to match a Carmine 6? If you, if it doesn't. You look it up, it says made in China. Now, here's what I'll tell you. I have another pair of white Navy Jordan 6s. You wouldn't assume that they can be made in different places? Midnight Navy 6s was such a flop. They're in outlets. They're going for under retail. You don't think they've, they've made them in multiple different places? The shit he's talking about doesn't correlate to any of our pairs. I'm our pairs just telling be you, I was told specifically from Nike that they should have a made in China tag. Okay. So the ones, so the ones that I buy from Foot Locker and Finish Line that say made in Vietnam are fakes. Then the ones that I get from the Nike outlet are fakes as well. No, I understand what you're saying, but I bought shoes from these stores too, and they say made in Vietnam, so they're not real. Uh, brother, I, again, that's what I was talking. Okay. That's what I was talking. But what? Well, you don't think I've done my? We don't like what's going on. What do you do for a living? Like I do this for a living every single day. There's no way these shoes are fake, bro. And the fact that you got them from StockX, all those people who get hired and work there, you think they're gonna pass a Midnight Navy Six that's fake? You know what I mean? And I understand if you're telling me that you're trying to help us, that's fine. But leave the jobs to the experts. I'm just gonna assume you don't do this every day, right? This isn't how you feed your family. Authenticating shoes, right? I'm just, I'm, I'm just keeping it real. I'm just keeping it real, like. So if there's a difference between China and Vietnam, does that mean they're fake? Like what 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 difference are you telling me that you see? Recently listed, uh, what was it like last week? The uh, Michigan State Ducks, eight and a half. Brand new? Uh, no, I think it was used. Highs? Uh, no, I think it was lows. Stuff. What, like 80 bucks for this? Okay. 40 and 40. Do you do? No, those are, those are pretty used. Those are brand new. How much you said for the Air Forces again? 40? These two I'll probably have to pass on. Um, really low? Well, these are low. The Air Force is definitely low. Yeah. And a used GS we don't really take because they don't really move. But I'll probably just hold off on those two. Um, I could take these for 80. I could drop those two to 220. And 140 would be the difference. And what about the Air Force? I'll pass on right those two. They're going like 60, 70. I'll just hold off on them, honestly. What? Give me 20 and 20. To make it 120, so 100 on top. Yeah. Uh, I'll take a chance at that. Did it travel time? Yeah, let me see. You had also some Carolina, um, or UNC, uh, uh, dunks, but those are size 8. So, can I see those? those ones? Yeah, I think those are brand new. No, never mind. I think they're 8.5. Uh, the dunks are right here for you. Yeah, I like the snugger fit on these. Okay. I'll take these. Which ones? The uh, universe. Should I do uh, 80 difference then? Okay. Thanks, bro. Good, no problem. Take care, man. Can I see them? I just gotta get the cold drill first. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Thanks, man. No problem, man. All right, man. Going. Take care, man. You too. I just had a bunch of stuff I was looking to trade and okay. sell kind of a thing. Clothes, shoes first. What do you prefer? Uh, Shoes first. Cool. This is, <laughs> I don't know if you're interested or not. They're a pair of IDs 
I went to Montclair, so an ex got them for me. And I was like, all right, we're close enough. Maybe someone will want them. Probably hold off one. That's fine. That's straight. I figured. <laughs> I was just like, I'll, I'll bring them up and see what's good. And then just a pair of 95s. And and what were you asking for the these three? Um, I was just gonna see what you had in mind in like trade value. Okay. Do you have eleven and a half in the Kith New Balance nine nineties? The V three. The yeah. Is that the Genesis pair? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Someone's all bought them. Nah. What about a size twelve in the? They're on your eBay. The uh, Joe Fresh Goods. Is that the 9060? No, no, the 990. These one here, I have a photo of them. Oh, those are those are back there. Yep, yeah, these. Yeah. It was these ones and then those ones. Oh, that Kith one. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So the Joe Fresh goods are back there in the corner. Cool. I'm gonna have someone bring over that uh, cool. the Kith pair. What were you thinking for the three shoes, price wise? Um, did you have? I I didn't know what you had in mind on these two. Since the, I know these are worn, obviously, so I just wanted to more see what you had each piece, and then, like I said, I'll probably just be trading. But thank you. Okay. And you have clothes too. Yeah, yeah. I just a bunch of vintage stuff, just tank tops, shorts, a little bit of everything. I'll move this down here. Move those up, yeah, so you can make a good and profile. Yo, what's good, bro? Let's go, bro. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Almost short seasons. <laughs> almost. Yeah, almost short seasons. So I was just like, oh, bro. What year you graduated from Montclair? Uh, 17? You might be So, looking to sell? I graduated. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, nice. There you go. Yeah. You I always get happy when I hear someone say they're from Montclair. Right, exactly. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm Monmouth <laughs> County, born and raised. Okay. But, um, but that's why, like, I was like, you know what? I'm going to run up. Like, who knows? Someone will, you know. Because okay. like, I think, were you, did you guys have another location? Yeah. Were you at another spot? Oh, yeah, over there. That was that was, that was a little while ago. So yeah. by, probably when you were in school. Um, yeah. Oh, thank you. When you were in school, that's about the time. Probably in that other spot. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's what I had thought. Like I said, a little bit of everything. <laughs> uh, okay. And were you trying to get both shoes today or just one? Uh, what kind of more or less just whatever you thought value wise. I'll see if I can, you know, trade for one and then just kind of what you thought on the other kind of, you know. Okay. I'd like to get both if I could, but okay. again, it'll probably just depend on what you've got to value. I don't know if that's a boot. I think it might be. I have like a couple tees in here that might be boots. I'm not even sure, but. Uh, I'm buying it. Nike crew neck. Give me, uh, mm, okay. <laughs> you make money. Give me like one six. No Nike tag. Clothing's been a little tricky for us. Yeah, I could leave, bro. But let me see. Yeah, I mean, just like I said, I'm I'm just doing whatever I can to both. try to get as close to the pair as possible. So ah, this stuff I'll probably hold off for. Right, cool. This stuff I might be interested in. Let me see what I come up. Yeah, I got another. I got another bag here too. Anyways. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got a couple more things. So. I would take these two. Okay. For the Joe Fresh Goods, if you wanted to do that, and then I could put everything else towards the kit. Okay. What do you have? What do you have these guys at just off the I back? value these pretty well, like 150 for us, okay. the 380 miles. Just yeah, it just sell doesn't sell. Us. Yeah, I feel you. Um, um, so that's kind of where I was at. I was at 170 for this yeah. stuff right here. 170. Yeah, that's where I was at. Um, what I had said before was these two for the drink mm -hmm. So this would basically just be like 100 value minus these guys. You're saying if I did these straight up for the Joe Fresh Goods? Mm -hmm. This would be a hundred. Uh, roughly yes. Okay. Um, and then I, I don't know what this is priced. At. I think the price at three hundred. I think you had these at three and these at two twenty, so it's five total. Well, this was two forty. I'm, I'm oh, valuing okay. it as two twenty if you okay. did these two. Yep. Okay, let me see if I can drop those two because I don't know what mark on. Yeah, let me know. I do like two fifty on them basically. Would be these guys. Yeah. So one fifty would be the difference. If we did the first that I told you yeah. about, yeah. Would you do these guys and this stack for the Joe Fresh? So it'd be minus these two. 
So just this stuff for the Joe Fresh. Oh, so the hundred was with the the Cybers. Yeah. So you you had these at one fifty. Yeah. You had these valued at oh, two twenty. Yeah. So I'm more saying this that. is like fifty ish probably, right? So it's basically two. Uh -huh. So we're like twenty short. Okay. So I was gonna say that for the Joe Fresh, clear it, and then do these two. You had at like one seventy, right? So well, that was seven. I value that seventy, and I value the the Cybers like around fifty. So it was like uh, 120, I believe that is. 120, okay. Yeah. Um, so it'd be basically 120 towards these at three right now. Oh, 250, I dropped that too. 250, so, yeah, so I'd be 30. 130 short. Yeah. Cool, so can we keep at that, see if there's anything else to move me closer to these guys in this bag? Let me see what you have. Yeah. Let me see what else you I'll, have in a bag. Yeah. Before I, I also, do I do have one more. Okay. I have one more bag in my car, okay. so I was gonna. I parked over at like Calandra's because there was yeah. no parking over here. But I said worst case, if I like, if we can get a little closer, I'll go gr pull it up, grab it, and then just kind of let you okay. run through it. Yeah. Let me see what else you have. Yeah, cool. Because I was determining like. What I had I do. these two. I was also gonna ask you had Giants fitteds on the eBay shop. That that was know. a little different. That was like um like. We were helping someone out. Gotcha. So like, so it wouldn't be trade; it'd be mm -hmm. buying. Gotcha. Yeah. Cool. So that's straight. Then the, yeah, those are just brand new guys. So, so the hat I'll probably hold off cool. on. Cool. That's fine. It's a thin trail. Um, mm. <laughs> I obviously, you know, I don't know how they go. So I was like, you know what? Let me let me bring the bin trail hoodie, but old school Nike. Say uh, Bob Marley. Well, I said these two for that, mm -hmm. and I said this with that. What was that deal again? Just so I remember. Um, I think you lowered this one down to t was it two fifty, and then you were taking the balance of these off of the two fifty. So two fifty minus you had this at fifty, and then you had that at let's just say it's a fifty. So it's a hundred. Okay. It's basically one fifty balance. Yeah, um, I would do a 125 balance. Well, that was without the McGuire tee, right? I know it's probably five bucks or whatever. You're yeah, for so it. Um, that's. I would, would you I would, would you just do one? If it was like a sneaker, like another mm -hmm. sneaker on top, I would probably be able to work with you a little bit mm -hmm. more. The problem is that it's clothing. Mm -hmm. So clothing is a lot harder for us to move, yeah, opposed yeah. to it being a sneaker, you know? Yeah. Like, we could probably move these two really fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and move these really fast. The question is how long is it going to take? Yeah. The clothing, yeah, stuff, I feel you. Know you. What I'm saying. Um, so I would probably have to be stuck at the 125 because again, like I do see that the, the kits are a lot lower. Yeah. Than um, where they're at online. Could you do like one, like 110, 115 on top, or like? I'm probably stuck at that 125. Okay. And there was no, uh, there was no other tees that you were like kind of like. No. Mm -mm. We can just run it as is. The one twenty five. Yeah. Okay. And we'll good. That's good. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, um, car or should I just, like, do? Um, I was telling him there. Yeah, Velo, ones low, Apple air dry, gray, gray okay, cool. skin something. Yeah, hey, yeah, you are all set. Good to go. All right, yeah. thank you, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate that one. Man. Six thirty here, wrapping up. Today was a good day. Got a lot of stuff done. A lot of stuff on the eBay. Not a lot of buying today, but still a good day. Yeah, that's it for me. Before I do this one and done, we got a video dropping tonight. Hope you guys enjoy that and got more content on the way. So stay tuned. YouTube, what is good? We are back. We have some orders. So let's look at them real quick. Up here, beautiful Storm Blue Royal next to Hyper Royal Mid. Billy Eilish 15s. They tried. I mean, they're not terrible. Could be better. Could be worse. Cool Grays, Canvas, Taupe, Union, 72 and 10. More LeBron Love, Kobe Love. I don't know. Those look like some Model basketball shoes, but you know, you could definitely get a bucket in those. We got some Crocs. Can't lie, when I got those Crocs, I thought they'd you know bubble up to like a thousand dollars, and I didn't really think that they would make so many colorways. They definitely did do that though. So I'm glad those sold they actually sold for 360 dollars after fees so happy about that we got a camel back camel bag i call it both but i think it's technically camel back backpack sip a little something while you're walking or running or whatever you want to do bought a lot of those at the flea market sold that one for 27 dollars ship and guys if you want one we probably still have more for the low ski top shelf hey what's up i'm just uh, calling to see if you got my taxes oh uh, yeah the three pairs right yep 
Yeah, I was gonna say next time, bro, you should have hit us up. We could have tried to help, like, figure out a better way to ship it, just, just so you didn't pay so much, you know? Yeah, that was a crazy amount. When I, I thought it was that told me when I, she told me one. Yeah, my bad, man. Next time you should have, like, hit us up or, or just, like, waited a day. We would have figured out a better way. Usually UPS is better. And I think it was also just because yeah. their box was, like, super big, you know? That's what she told me. Yeah, so sorry about that, but uh, if you want to just shoot us another DM, just like bump yours up to the top, and we're going to get back to you today, and then make sure to get that trade handled for you. Yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, no problem, man. Have a good one. That's some info out there for you guys if you want to ship stuff. Usually, if you're shipping like a, a big shipment from across the country or something like that, use UPS. Priority mail is really good, but it's expensive for sure. You're going to probably pay double shipping USPS as opposed to UPS. We got the Kentucky High skater shoes. We got the barber shops, which we've had for quite some time. They finally sold. We got some pandas. One of my favorite right there the dusty cactus air max 93s right mm -hmm. really like that sneaker have a bunch of them wore through them what sucks though is the ds pair start getting yellow like around the bubble area that's probably a nike that nike will continue to re-retro though because you know guys like me really love them we got the lemonada or lemonade or something like that air max ones that we had for quite some time we got a sixers jacket rangers jacket nike jacket volcom jacket that i thrifted like 10 years ago something crazy like that back when there was a goodwill in fairfield on 46 never thought it would sell it finally did got a 97 and we have a electro lime foam posit that was a 99 cent auction finished at about 60 dollars and that's about it from what's going out today evan anything about the orders for the people yeah it's a, it's a good little badge shout out the person who bought those storm blues those are perfection to me shout out the person who bought the unions and uh shout out the person who bought that volcom jacket you know back in the day that was a vibe if you know you know shout out the person who bought the crocs you know that colorway was gonna go for way more he just started pumping up more colors and i guess that one decreased a little bit but still really cool croc pandas always good seeing those go out those are always flying out really like those Kobe's when i saw that sale yesterday i was like damn he got a good one and these unions right here shout out to the person who bought those even just shipping and selling out unions left and right so shout out to whoever bought those i got a shout out also david david hit us up and he wants this nine pair order there's some really good stuff in there like true blue threes ds a lot of 11 and a half so we appreciate the support there john we got to get that package out shout out to john i'm not gonna lie i was thinking if we took those shoes and put them down it would be crazy because like lost and founds more unions and shit like that but yeah definitely Definitely a good batch going out. Not really much else to say other than we're uh, working hard here. Got a lot of work to do. I know for getting stuff on the eBay, stuff around the store, I got to get the locksmith here to fix the front door. Just doing a lot of stuff here. That's always good. And uh, let's see what happens today. All right, real quick, a lot of stuff going out. But uh, of course, uh, we got this beautiful Michael Lewis authentic Eagles jersey. A lot of Eagles stuff has been selling recently. You know, it feels good. I have this crazy collection of Eagles jerseys that I keep for myself. But uh, I definitely had a couple of them on the eBay store. I know we sold this one we sold the kevin cobb we sold a lot of mcnabs a lot of the cheaper stuff has sold but it's just really nice seeing something like this because again you just can't go a lot of places and find stuff like this size 46 great condition reebok authentic just you know stuff you don't see nowadays so shout out to him for the support we're going to ship this out and hopefully it's going to get there before the super bowl so we can wear it for the super bowl and uh, hopefully the eagles win the super bowl because if they don't the vibe in here might not be the best next week just kidding i mean you know it's just football it is what it is but uh, yeah this one's going out amongst other things so let's see what else happens today Stuff we, we really never really take. Okay. Them different though. Yeah, yeah. Different. No, they're, they're crazy. Them different. Them different. I don't know. I try to look my best to look them up. How about that Bob Pierce? I didn't know that I had a sneaker. How about that Bob Pierce sneakers too? Don't worry. No, I, I understand. I just. It's I'm just. Grown ass, I love throwing them things. Stop rapping, man. How much is this right here? Size 9. Uh, I don't know if we have size 9 of those. I, I think got we the have. the jacket for this, you know. Remember? No, I'm going to show you the jacket. I'm going to fold it. Yeah, they're, they're pretty cool. I just think we're probably gonna pass on them. We just don't do well with design and stuff, you know what I mean? Sorry about that. No shit though. Um, have you tried the, there's a store in Montclair. I don't know if you've tried them. Somebody other please, Montclair. I'm just trying to get a couple down here. Off-white 3.0s, I haven't even seen these. How much do these even go for a lot, right? Like 500 or something you guys are looking yeah. for? Yeah, they, they crazy. Like, that's what I said, you could. Why would you? I want to pass on those. You want to catch them? Like, come yeah, in but what size is this? Is this shoe right? Which one are you looking at? Because I want to show you. Oh yeah, no problem. This is a ten and a half. Ten and a half. Yeah, those are the infrared. I'm find sixes. somebody in here. I'm gonna call my man right now. Right now. Yeah, no problem. Guys. What you be getting? Like what kind of shoes you get? Jordans and stuff like that. We usually buy. Uh, what is these? We buy these. Yeah, sometimes. How much you pay for these? Right now. Oh, you don't have like uh, wave runners or probably more like brand new stuff with well, the yeah. easy zoo. So that sneaker would go with it. Oh, yeah, that probably would. Yeah. 
Where my cut? I'm gonna say how far my cut. Like three miles down the road. Yeah, that's not far. How much is this thing? Uh, I think they're like 300. Yeah. Something like that, yeah. You take a picture. Yeah, no problem. Come on. Come on. Let's go. We got the Supreme Collection and all. I really see sneakers here. Huh? I really see sneakers here. When they be showing these stuff off on YouTube, I tell you, I got that. These guys be doing. Oh, y'all yeah, be watching YouTube? They really be showing like they sneak it, and then they always got a, a Supreme yeah, no section, problem, all white yeah. and red Supreme section, white and red yeah, Supreme yeah. section in there. Yeah, yeah. And they go spot. Come on, come on, come no, on, Luke. No, no, no. <laughs> Luke. Peace, God. Yes. Thank you. All right, y'all. Thank y'all. No problem. What's going on, YouTube? Brown back with another unboxing and uh happy thursday to all you happy campers out there super bowls are right around the corner so hope you guys have all your wings chips or beer ready for the game shout out to the eagles but yeah speaking about the eagles and speaking about green i was looking forward to this since the pictures came out i'm a big jordan 2 guy for you guys out there that are gonna say oh bro one's just hopping on the train because he twos are cool now no i actually really like twos that's one of my favorite og models top five in my opinion when i saw the pictures of these like leaks come out last year i was like i need those green looks so good on certain jordans fours threes some of the ones it looks good but twos i was not expecting so without further ado let's unbox it i don't think i actually need this i think nike just made it easier for us to open as you guys can see it comes in the air jordan 2 box that the chicago's came in as well as the off-whites except the off-whites were like clear box but this is the regular jordan 2 chicago 2 box nothing crazy size 8 white lucky green sale from the front tag i usually tell people to go a half size down in twos width wise it's fine but like as far as length they do run a little big so usually i'm an eight and a half in j's but in two specifically i'm an eight and wow Damn. Off rip, I think these kind of exceeded, not exceeded, but like, I guess the expectations are there. Nice green. I really like this sail, like midsole. I really like how the green pops a lot. I feel like this is another two that you beat it up. It's gonna look good. You know, the snake skin feels great. The bottom sole is still like that regular Jordan 2 color blocking, except it's green. I don't know, I just really like these. Like the green really pops on these. The lining from the tongue to the wing, just a great GR. These are still sitting on Nike in some sites. So if you are looking for these, they're still out. Out there i was really looking forward to these and i'm really glad i was able to hit on these with pretty good ease you know didn't have too much trouble on sneakers that morning for all you guys out there that hate the twos not for everyone i'll, I'll say that jordan twos did not as sought after as ones and fours and threes but really good model and honestly i think these are one of my favorite grs of the year so far hey would you like to speak out? Okay, yeah let me just hop in here real quick because you know it is about to be super bowl sunday and th these shoes definitely give off that eagle green vibe or jets or whatever i think they're very nice again like bro and i were kind of talking about earlier people definitely see on the twos it's not a very you know favorite sneaker i definitely see this one holding weight in years to come because it's just so crazy the green definitely pops one thing that i kind of noticed that's interesting is on the twos that just came out the nike on the back is kind of like pressed in there and stitched around it oh, where this wow. is fully stitched nike i guess maybe this is like more of an og feel and this is kind of more of like a re-retro i really like the yellowing here i think these will look really good beat up you could probably tell like this collar looks a little more worn in already than this oh, collar which wow. is kind of weird but i mean you feel that it actually feels really good i was really really excited that I was able to hit for these for retail honestly regardless of what they're going for because I was excited for them and I'm happy that they're I was able to get a pair I didn't see mine in person yet they're waiting at my house because I think they came in today but yeah it's just something different I think it's hard for people to spend a lot of money on like green sneakers or yellow sneakers or orange sneakers or purple sneakers because a lot of those colors can't really wear as much so I see why you know this one's probably still available and, and not going for much but don't let that deter you from realizing this is a you know crazy I guess we could call it a retro plus colorway definitely not going to sleep on these like I saw slept on the you know the green metallic fours and even the candy pack twos back in the day right the red the yellow the green like even those from what i remember they weren't hard to get at all they were kind of an easy shoe to acquire berwin mentioned the box too really cool that you get the og2 box do they come with the little in insert too no insert which is interesting so the insert is held for these any other differences not really i mean other than that's what i could see i mean this is all obviously like you said that off-white are you going to put cream laces in them is the question they're already, they're already there these are cream laces i don't think they're, they're like a, they're like a light sale <laughs> no 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 are they Damn, I don't know actually now that i'm looking but yeah really cool sneaker and again i get hyped man when, when retros come out and they're easy to get like 
word. I don't know why. It just hypes me up. I feel like that's what it's all about. Like Jordan should be easy to get. It shouldn't all, always be about like the stuff that sells out or the stuff that's going for eight hundred to a thousand dollars. It should be about the stuff that you really like and uh, you want to buy. And it shouldn't be so hard to buy it. So I think it's a really nice sneaker. I can't wait to uh, get mine. I hope you use. Yeah. No, no, no. What did you want for golfing? Oh, uh, whatever. Yeah, I was willing to offer me. I was looking for at least, you know, 120 minimum, I guess. Or Each? whatever. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. But if anything, I'll take anything. So in total, you want like 240? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're just looking to sell them, right? Mm hmm. Um, are you negotiable at all? Like 200, 100 each, something like that. More like uh, a little more here, a little less here. Yeah, I, I figured that. Yeah, I mean, they're not terrible condition, but they got some scuffs and stuff, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, but if two cash would work, I think I'm cool with that. A little more store credit if you want to store credit. Yeah, I'll take cash. Uh, 200 would be fine. That's cool. Um, do you have Venmo, Apple Pay, Zelle? I have. Apple Pay and Cash App, if that works. Gotcha, yeah, we can Apple Pay you, bro. Just give me one second. Had these for a minute. Yeah, well, and then back just, in the day. Yeah, yeah it was just sitting. I'm like, you know what, fuck it. Yeah. I gotta go back on campus too, and I need the money. Yeah, no, I feel that. Alright, cool. Um, you said Apple Pay works, right? Yeah. I know 150 is pretty hard if they're going for that price. Oh, what size are these? Size no, it's eight. not my size. No, that's his size. What you want for these? One fifty. One thirty. I could go one thirty, but like I know one fifty is pretty pretty right. hard. You try returning them? I don't got the receipt anymore. Where'd you get them from? Willowbrook. How no, long? Mellow, ago? mellow. November. Oh, on Fall Locker? Snipes. Oh yeah. What's the lowest you'll take on them? Like one twenty. Yes. Yeah. I'm gonna hold. Shoot me an offer. Don't tell me that. Because they don't fit on me. They, they just tight on me. Like really, really They run tight. small. They definitely run small. I'll do like 80 on them. Try to get like 120. If it was store credit, while I'm there. Yeah, look around, see, see what you find. I'll work with you. Hey guys, no, what's up, bro? Hey. No, I'm around here. What are you asking for this stuff? Um, well, I was trying to see what you guys would value it at, and um, maybe if she wants a shoe, she might. Um, Any price in mind, though? Um, around 1300 Like for this stuff? Yeah. Maybe like 1250 The two zebras are brand new, the four numbers are brand new. Brand new. The only used ones are the Citroen, the Israel. So I'm guessing these are the heavy hitters. If this is the shoe, I think it is. Oh, never mind. No, no, no. I think it's the other spirit dance. Nah, I got the. No, the other one's around my crib. <laughs> yeah, I, I got those though. I know what you're talking about. How much are you asking for the statics? At the bottom. Mm -hmm. The black ones? No, the ones to the right of it. Well, the statics, no? With the all the analogs? Yeah. Oh, that's like a size 13, I think. Yeah. Oh, they have a wave on it. No, I thought that was a static. No, a wave on it. And you said two two brand new zebras and one used one, right? Yeah, the used one is this uh, one. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Two brand new. These are the brand new ones. And then you said 1,200. Like 1,250. I was staring at them. You like those? Yeah. Oh. Um, they might have your size. I mean, they just released. I was at a thousand for everything. A thousand? Um, Not that far off, but. Yeah. I mean, can we meet in the middle somewhere? Like 11? Uh, let me try 1050. Alright. That's cool. Yeah, I got you. Uh, Zell? Um. Can you do. Your thing? Wait, wait, find a shoe though. Wait, we're not. We're not How much are those orange ones? <laughs> yeah, do you have her size? That's the only size we have. Mm. What size is it? Ten and like a half. Ten, I will say we, we do have them priced pretty high right now just because we feel like they're going to go up. Uh, we have True. them priced at like uh, seven, 
probably take anywhere of 200. No, not even your size. Yeah, this sucks. I'll buy them all day. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, probably like 650, 675, something like that. Uh, what size you looking for? Six, if you it's said? men's, I need a seven. Men's seven. If it's a girl, I need an eight and a half, nine. And what are you looking for? Like anything or like Jordan ones? Anything that catches my eye. Well, anything that catches her eye. <laughs> She likes the green Paisley Air Force One with the green stripe, like the Paisley stripe on it. What are these and why are they on the floor? Those sold. They had no box. Oh. Uh, yeah, but, all right. uh, what is it? Thanks, bro. Yeah, no problem. Appreciate you guys. Thanks, bro. See you guys soon. Thank you. I don't know if I talked to you the other day for the Legends Mode on the floor. That's not the same. That's not the same. For 200. Yo, Don't think it was me, but yeah, that's right. they said that was fine. Yeah, okay. I have a message in there. Right. Uh, you have more stuff? Yeah, I just want to see what you guys would offer for these. Those good deals? Yeah. Nice. <coughs> what do you have for them? Probably like 60 bucks each. Horses? Uh, 40. 40. And how much you said for the Air Force? You got my fault. About 40. 40? One, oh, no, no, 40. Oh, 40, okay. Yeah. That's so weird. These two items be super, super at least not, really I think at least Pretty sure you're not really selling all that. Right you want to hold on? Yeah, probably just hold on to them. Okay. Um, you, can, you can do the 40 on these? Would, yeah, that's cool. Alright, cool. Yeah, no, I mean, I'll just. No, what, uh, what would you offer on? Just due to the where I, I could do one for another pack. Like 40 for both. Uh, 45, 100. Yeah, and these pairs are going <coughs> for like 40, 50. Yeah, that's yeah. all right. right. If anyone, I'll bring these. them back. Let me, let me yeah. think about it. Yeah. yeah. No problem. Just because I don't really see them. So. No, yeah, but trust me, those, I, I, I love yeah. crazy. Yeah. That's, it's just I have the rain, other ones, the that. remixes. The yeah. ones with all the crazy they colors. Sell, but they're not they all different colors. It's like a rainbow colored one. That's fine. You're not able to come up a little bit on these? At all, like 210, 220. Last year was 238, and there's a couple more of 230, 220, 250. So I'll probably do 240 for both. You could do 250 at least? Um, uh, 20, 720. Yeah, that's fine. All right, cool. What's the best way I would pay? Um, what's the best way for you? Oh, uh, no. Oh, uh, yeah, Zell, Cash. Either or doesn't matter. Yeah, you text it, right? Yeah. Uh, Zell's cool. Zell's cool. Yeah. Right, cool. Just run, run, check these real quick. How much? Two fifty. Where are these? Cause I, I've had them and I just never want to wear them. They're brand new. That's uh, where they sit over there. And where'd you get these? Uh, I got them in retail, I think. Oh wow. I don't remember. It was a while back, but I know I bought them when they first dropped, pretty much. Yeah, this stuff is used now. No, this is all new too. All that stuff. Come on, bro. What's up? Yeah. Uh, he called it earlier. Um, about these. One in nine. Said it didn't sound bad, but we could take a look into it because they're brand new. Okay. Um, and then this stuff we didn't speak about. No. So just this, you said nine, right? Yeah. yeah. Alright. No white laces with them? No. And then it come with them? Probably didn't get them. Alright. And where'd you get the fives from? The fives? Yeah. I think I got one from stock, so I don't remember. You have to um, the order? I'm not gonna lie to you, so long ago, I definitely don't. I think I could have ran it through my mom's account or something, I have no idea. And how much you want for this stuff over here? Together? Mm hmm. Probably like, you do nine for this? Nine for this? Yeah. They're all dead stock. Those are the black foam runners. I got no receipts for these though. You all can get yes. Probably like a round of it. This one too? Yeah. These I'll be super low, the midnight navies, if I took them. Like how much? They're going for under retail. Um, I'll probably be at like 120 for them. Really black, I'll be around like 250 for them. These I will pass on. They just don't move well for us. So that one I might hold off for just because it doesn't have white laces. I know 
it's not that big of a deal, but it kind of is just in the fact that like it's one of the main colors that people like to put in there in the off white. So I might just hold off on those for now. But I will take these two though if you want to do that. There we can do like one fifteen two seventy five. I'll probably be stuck out where I'm at. These are low. Yeah, I know these are. But these are easy for not really that inclined to buy them right now because that's that's why I was at where I was at. You can probably get more somewhere else. You gonna hold on to everything? Yeah. Okay. Been up here, it's probably a pretty slow day. Not sure how much we got on film. Just everyone who pulled up, We've been putting a lot of stuff on eBay. We surpassed 5,100 active items, so I'm hoping we can stay above 5,000 as consistent as possible. We're definitely trying our best to list whatever we have for sale, so that's always working out well. We have a long ways to go though. This weekend, big weekend, obviously Super Bowl Sunday. It is Sneaker Con. We're going to be open here though. I might go to Sneaker Con and try to get some footage, hopefully find some good stuff. But um, shout out to all you guys for making Saturdays in here crazy because because of that, I don't really want to be closed on Saturday. Saturdays, all you guys come from near and far and I just feel really bad if someone were to pull up on Saturday and we not be available and it be a day that you guys like only day you guys can make the trip so shout out to all y'all for purchasing stuff on the eBay as well and watching the content we appreciate it all Jordan came here a little late today but he's here I don't know if we've established that yet but Jordan is in the building and yeah that's about all it is for me anything else for the people oh. Super Bowl prediction <laughs> Super Bowl prediction first up Berwin said that Kelsey and Jalen Hurts are gonna score that's what Berwin said so just so y'all know <laughs> that's what Berwin said you know, a lot of people don't call me a trader because I've been saying Eagles all year but I, I've had had the Eagles all year a, a is a testament he's a witness I've had Eagles all year my prediction was Eagles versus Ravens in the Super Bowl love Jalen Hurts love his story he's got that dog could never like not root for a guy like him you know like his story is crazy so to see him win the Super Bowl and get like, a contract extension would be crazy so um really hoping for the Eagles to win I'll take the Eagles to win 31-21 is my score prediction the worst score prediction it's gonna be bad I hope one of you guys has the Chiefs Evan you have the Chiefs fuck no I don't have the Chiefs. Oh, I went Eagles. Um, I got the Eagles by like at least two touchdowns. Oh my god. And I'm throwing it out there. Miles Sanders and Goder. Those are my two guys for wow. any time. Don't take them, but I'm taking them. All I know is last time I wore this jacket was a year before we won. So, you know, I had to pull this one back out. Buck got to it, made, up, made it a little messy, but I, I said, hey, you know, last time I wore it, we had a great season. We ended up winning it all. So, you know, got to pull it back out. My prediction, Eagles win 28 to 17. Very, so weird, number. very weird, weird number. I don't know why you guys put me on the spot. My prediction for a guy who's going to score, I think Jalen is going to run one in and I think Boston Scott or Gainwell, one of those two guys is going to score a touchdown. Originally had AJ Brown. I thought this was his day. He's going to go crazy and I shot away from that, which means he might go crazy. So I don't know. Let's just hope the Eagles win. That's, that's, that's what we all want. We all want the Eagles to win. That would be great. You know what? If the Eagles win, $100 store credit. So if you're watching this right now and the Eagles won the Super Bowl, drop a comment and you're entered to win a hundred dollars for credit <laughs> boom go birds one and done here we go line them up knock them down oh 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 oh